Who's scared of blusher? I used to be. I used to be scared of blusher. I now have blusher in <laughs> lots of different colours. The two I'm going to show you is this dusky pink and two blushes. Yeah, you know, two blushes. This bright pink. Can you see? They're beautiful. Aren't they beautiful? Now, I could just use one blusher and I will show you where I put one blusher. So I'd get my blushy brush and then I'd put it in here. Now, oh my life, <laughs> I can't wait to get a fan brush because that will make this a lot easier. But while I don't have a fan brush, and for you guys that don't have a fan brush, a blusher brush, blusher, and you literally go, Tap! Can you see? You can't even see, okay? That little, that little amount. And then you just blend it up. And if you imagine my contour went here, my blusher is just going slightly above that. Okay? You see? Okay. Now, if you want a little bit more, I wouldn't always do a little bit more, but I'll show you. If you want a little bit more, again, brush a tiny little bit. And then again, just here. You just put it there. So simple. Contour, blusher, okay? And then I'm going to do the other side. Again, tap. Put a little bit too much on there. And then you find it up. Again, above the contour, above below the highlight that you can put on. You just put that brush in there. Again, back in, tiny top. A little bit more. And there you go. So, for those of you out there that just like to use a little bit of colour and that don't want to have a lot of blush on, that's how you do it. Just one colour, a tiny tap. Not always two coats, I think it's gone on a bit. Um, not always two coats. And that's where you put it. Now, I use two colour blushes. And so, bright pink and a highlight blush. Okay, so if you imagine this is an earthy blush, a contour blush, this is a highlight blush. So again, I get the blusher brush. Uh, I can't wait for a fan brush. Again, tiny bit dip it in, tap it off, and it has just gone on that tip of this brush, and I just put it here. And the reason for this is because it just gives it a little bit of a colour pop and a highlight, and I like to bring it up in line with my eye and down. Your face is not a shed. Don't paint it all just one colour. Okay. And remember that foundation, foundation isn't a concealer, it's there to allow you to put more makeup over the top. Okay. So, there we go, that's my blush. It looks quite bright in this light, but I can promise you it isn't. If you want to just blend them all together afterwards, what I, to, 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 what I tend to use is this brush. Like that, and then the other side. Now, I don't have a setting powder, so what I tend to put over it at this stage is my powder foundation, touch foundation. I use it in scarlet. I can't wait to get a setting powder. I just dab, 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 all over my face. But paying special attention to the places that might attract oil. Very light, and I don't smush because that'll move the, that, the uh, makeup that I've got. Okay. So that is my blusher and my foundation all done. Um, I'm going to show you something exciting next. Highlighters. So keep an eye out. Alright, love you. Bye. Mwah.